Hello everybody, what is going on? It's Corey here, and a lot of you have been having problems with the Aether mod, so I'm going to address those, and um, hopefully help you, and uh, hopefully I can get it working, uh, since uh, I can't answer all of your PMs, I actually gotten like 10 already, and the video went up like an hour ago, so that's a lot. So um, before I get more PMs and uh, overwhelmed, I'm just going to make uh, this simple uh, troubleshooting guide type of thing to um, show you. So go back to your percent app data. Uh, these are common problems um, in your .minecraft. Um, uh, probably uh, one of the things is uh, you didn't uh, delete your Minecraft, uh, not Minecraft, your meta-in folder, um, which is in here. If you go um, to your Minecraft.jar, open archive, your meta-in folder that's in here under M, uh, you got to delete that folder, else the mod won't work. Um, so that's the first thing. Um, another thing is uh, maybe install it. <coughs> Could have been installing. Uh, let me see which one is it. Give me a second. Let me open this. Okay. Um, it could have been installing Shaka API, which um, if you see here, you probably dragged all of this into the Minecraft.jar. Um, so you probably dragged all of this into the Minecraft.jar, and you're only supposed to drag what's in the bin folder. So you open the bin folder, and you actually drag all of these .doc class files into the Minecraft.jar. So that's one of the problems that I faced um, trying to install it. So um, also one other thing is uh, I've heard it doesn't work with single player commands. So that's probably another thing. So what you want to do is uh, uh, go to your saves and uh, save your actual world here. Uh, any world that you don't want to get deleted, put it to your desktop and save it and uh, go back here and delete your whole .minecraft folder and then open up Minecraft, redownload it and then try to do the installation again and then uh, once you actually install the Aether and have it work and then you can try to install your other mods again and then you can know which ones collide uh, with the current Aether mod so because sometimes the mods they crash because they're trying to both change something at the same time so it just crashes because I mean you can't have them fighting against each other because that just doesn't work. Computers don't work like that. So um, those are the only things that I can think of. And uh, also maybe when you're installing the actual Aether mod right here, um, when you open this, if you look at the resources, uh, you probably didn't drag it in right. All you got to do is drag this same, just like it is the resources folder into the not Minecraft folder right here, not into the resources folder here, but just drag it into here. It will merge with that one. It will merge, and then it'll work. And what's inside of the jar? Don't you gotta in, um, put all of this inside of the Minecraft jar, and not the folder itself. So, if you do all of this uh, troubleshooting, uh, make sure uh, you do it like I said. Um, if none of it works, remember try the deleting your dot Minecraft and save your world saves if uh, you actually care about them. So and then try it again. And if it still doesn't work, then um, send me a message. But I'm I'm 99.9999 percent sure that it will work after this. So um, yeah, uh, leave me a comment below if it worked, and uh, don't forget to leave a thumbs up if it actually did work. So uh, yeah, thanks for watching, guys, and uh, yeah, see y'all later. Peace out.